Okay, I'm back again with a quick solar update. This time, this 300 watt grid time inverter. Just got this a couple of days ago. Uh, I actually hooked it up right as soon as I got the box. Uh, but unfortunately, that was during the nighttime. But uh, anyway, this grid time inverter I actually got for free uh, because I entered a grid time inverter giveaway contest from a YouTube user named OBXO Win. Uh, he has a really cool channel. You guys should definitely go over there and check it out and also subscribe. I'll go ahead and post this link in the description below. But um, really, really cool device. Uh, this thing normally costs around 100 bucks, and I got it for free. And um, it's actually working pretty good considering there's a lot of snow outside. You guys can see the fan is actually on right now, and it's uh, ticking away there. I don't have a uh, watt meter yet, so I can't tell you the wattage is putting back into the grid, but I'm pretty sure it's probably about 50 or 60 watts, uh, just depending on the um, amount of sunlight we have outside. But you can see there's lots of snow out there. I did the snow three times and uh, cleaned off those panels about four or five times. And they're actually working pretty good, at least the ones up top. The ones at the bottom, not so much. Uh, but um, you guys can see I added another 50 watt panel uh, for a total of 100 watts to go into the grid tie system. And uh, I guess it's getting some pretty good watts because it's, uh, it's not really getting that warm, but you guys can see the fan is on and the lights are going and uh, I kind of have it temporarily rigged up because each time it snows I just disconnect it and I didn't want to have to screw this ring terminal completely off but um works out pretty good and not only did he send the uh, grid time inverter he went ahead and sent the directions for it as you guys can see so I know exactly how to set it up and everything like that it's pretty nice and he also sent the sticker and I went ahead and put that on my laptop because that's usually what I do uh, with my other laptops. I have stickers all over them. Uh, this little netbook fit perfectly with this thing. And you can see that's his channel, OBX, Outer Banks, North Carolina. And um, that's pretty much it on the update. Uh, don't really know when I'm going to have another one. I have a couple of review videos coming up later on on a uh, spotlight and also some uh, rechargeable batteries. I think they're nickel zinc. But uh, check back for that later, and I just want to update you guys really quick on this. So see you guys later. Peace.